and congratulations on your win. Thank you. I caught some of um, your speech, which was really moving and um, really heartfelt. Um, you said it was one of the most complex characters that you've ever worked on. Um, how did you prepare for a character like that? Um, usually I just sit and absorb the script. This time around, I had the incredible Judy Davis actor help me out. So she came on board and uh, right at the beginning, it was just her and me over a number of weeks. She just sat with me and we went through a very early draft of, of and not all the episodes were written by then, um, but to have her expertise in finding, I guess, an entry into um, my character. Sorry, I'm getting away. I'm such a sook. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think half the, when you get great writers, you know, a um, fair bit of the work is already done. So for me, it is sitting down, absorbing the script, absor absorbing who Alex is as, as a person, you know, having the opportunity to um, have the guidance, f you know, from someone like Judy. And then once we get into rehearsal, it feels like, you know, that's when it really starts moving and, and you know, right up until cameras roll. And even then, you know, it's just really about play. And working with great actors, you know, to have the fortune of, you know, of course, Rachel Griffiths, who's just, uh, you know, I can't speak enough love for that woman. Um, but then to have Harry Richardson and Robbie Collins, Aaron Pedersen, Hugh Higginson, like it's just, you know, we're damn lucky to have actors like that in this show and in this country. So then it just becomes about enjoying the company of each other and just having, you know, just doing just having fun as yeah. much as you can when you read the script for the first time um what how did you feel oh so at the beginning of the show um for those who haven't seen it there's um a really um quite a dramatic scene that happens to my character she witnesses a gunman who sort of guns down his uh ex-wife and so that was there right from the go-get, from the beginning. And so when I read that very first scene, I was just like, it, it punched me. It sucker punched me. When a script can do that at its very early stages, I just went, wow, this, is, this could be a pretty amazing sort of ride as, as, um, as a story. So every time the scripts kept coming in, you know, the words kept getting be better, the dialogue became more wittier, and they just never stopped fine-tuning or finessing those stories they just kept doing it and so there was no complacency around the process of this which I think um, you know uh, it's, it's great working in that way and as an actor award, a multi-actor award-winning actress what is your number one tip to emerging artists that want to find their way in the industry it just if you can find some enjoyment I mean, seriously, it's a tough gig. It's a really hard industry, but I think, um, first of all, to have some enjoyment around it, some love for it, um, and be savvy. Like, I think that's, you know, you're seeing a lot of people who are able to sort of, you know, writers slash producer slash director slash, I think, you know, that's, I think that's a really important way to go in terms of the d diversifying your skills. Um, you know, as an actor especially, I mean, you know, don't be afraid to sort of look at writing, directing, and so you can balance a whole lot of skills because, you know, you never know when your next job's coming around. So I think it's about keeping yourself, keeping your creativity alive and moving forward in whatever way possible that is.